Okay, when the user feels ready to graduate to the next level of proficiency, we'll simply morph their class 1 browser into a class 2 browser. And voila! What's been added is a new row of buttons. Now let's switch over to the authorship paper where we can test drive these features. And we'll start by taking a look at these uh, dynamic trio of jump item, view specs, and filter. Now up until now we've been using the zoom buttons to jump and we've been using the numbers on the right as a handy point of reference. But now we get to use these numbers in a jump. For example, we can jump to item 3 Jump back to item 1, jump to item 6, or 3A, and back to 1. Pretty powerful stuff. Now the only thing the author of this paper uh, had to keep in mind while writing this document was just a little bit of structure in the document. So you put, have the headings and you have the other stuff down a level and uh, once you've done that the system provides all the rest, the numbering, the zoom buttons, the jumping capability and so on. And an added note that um, these particular numbers are called address numbers and um, there are a lot of other ways to address the paragraphs um, besides this, but this is typically uh, what a beginning level user would use.